Dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting further, I would like to tell you something. Please watch video completely and sit with copy pen. And if you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. If you find anywhere some problems or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share, and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Here is the question. Consider an LC circuit with inductance L equal to 0 0.1 Henry and capacitance C equal to 10 to the power minus 3 farad kept on a plane. The area of the circuit is 1 meter square. It is placed in a constant magnetic field of strength V0 which is perpendicular to the plane of the circuit. At time t equal to 0, the magnetic field strength starts increasing linearly. Here magnetic field B equal to B0 plus beta t with here given that beta equal to 0 0.04 tesla per second. The maximum magnitude, uh, magnitude of the current in the circuit is uh, in milliampere. This question is asked JE advanced 2022. In this question, we have given a circuit consists inductance coil and a capacitor and here inductance is 0 0.1 Henry and capacitance is given that 10 to the power minus 3 farad. This whole circuit kept in uniform magnetic field and its direction is inward inside the board. Okay. So therefore, here due to this induced EMF is generated and here the magnetic field is given that in the formula B equal to beta naught plus beta into T. And due to this induced EMF here the current flows in the circuit and we have to find out the maximum amount of current. Let us first we have to one by one we have to find out let us first we have found out the magnet uh, induced EMF and then current okay so firstly magnetic field b equal to beta naught plus beta into t differentiate with respect of t then db by dt here beta naught is given that constant and uh, beta naught beta and differentiation with respect of t of t that is one and so therefore db by dt and what is the value of beta 0 0.04 0 0.04 tesla per second that is db by dt and now we know that very well induced emf what is the formula of induced emf minus d phi by dt then uh, what is the phi phi is flux and formula of flux is magnetic field into area so here p into a here b is variable and a is area is constant so therefore it can be written as minus a d by dt and uh, what is the value of db by dt and what is the value of a here a is 1 meter square and 0 0.04 multiply then we will get 0 0.04 volt that is induced mf so here we get induced mf 0 0.04 volt that is passing through this circuit works as a cell or battery so here we can consider that is works as an cell so therefore 0 0.04 volt that is induced emf okay now here this emf is equal to sum of this potential which is passing through this inductance coil and the capacitance so here El and Ec. Here, what is the formula of El? Means potential in uh, inductance that is L into di by dt. And here in the capacitance that is Q by C. Here we have to find out the maximum amount of current. So therefore, by using the mathematical concept maxima minima, you are well known about that. Di by dt is equal to 0. So we get 
the value of maximum amount of current then substitute this value then we get emf equal to q by c then q can be written as emf into c what is the value of uh, emf that is 0.04 and what is the value of capacitance that is 10 raised to power minus 3 then q can be written as we are removing this decimal 1 0 0 10 raised to power minus 2 and minus 3 that is 4 into 10 raised to power minus 5 coulomb that is charge okay so here we get the charge in this case now applying laws of conservation of energy all energies consist in this capacitor capacitor and inductance coil that is equal to amount of work done by the battery or cell that is Q into EMF equal to 1 by 2 energy consist in that inductance coil that is 1 by 2 Li where I is maximum and 1 by 2 Q square by C. Here for our convenient EMF can be written as Q by C equal to 1 by 2 Li maximum Q square by 2C and it becomes Q square by C transposing this term Q square by 2C minus 1 by 2 L I maximum then solving this portion 2C taking LCM 2Q square minus Q square equal to 1 by 2 L I maximum here 2 to cancel out Q square by C, this L transposing and comes to the denominator of the left side, here I maximum that is square. So here I max equal to root Q square by LC. Now substitute the values Q square can be written as Q 1 by LC. Now substitute all this value. What is the value of charge that is 4 into 10 raised to the power minus 5. What is the value of inductance? Here 0 0.1 Henry. And what is the capacitance? 10 raised to power minus 3. Then it can be written as 10 raised to 4 into 10 raised to power minus 5. This remains this decimal and to Z10 and minus 3 reaches in the numerator, not become plus 3. Then uh, that becomes 10 raised to power 1 and 3, 4. 4 into 10 raised to power minus 5, 10 raised to power 2, then 4 into 10 raised to power minus 3 ampere, that is maximum amount of current. But we have to ask that I maximum find out in milli ampere. So therefore, 4 into 10 raised to power minus 3 ampere can be written as 4 milli ampere. So it is correct answer is 4 milli ampere. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of the video. And I remind you, those who have not subscribed yet, do it immediately by pressing bell icon. Thank you. Take care. Bye bye.